Imagine a world where there's nobody to write Egypt's history. There's nobody to research its culture. We have different layers of history here in the mosque of Ibn Tulun. There's nobody to research its language. There's nobody to write plays. One spell, you know the words. There's nobody who can make films about it without the arts, without humanities. When we take bodies, the body for us is, is an experience. Just imagine life without those things. The humanities and social sciences are disciplines that deal with the individual and society. When people study these disciplines, they're being taught how to communicate effectively, how to think critically, how to be leaders. It gives you perspective, this ability to work with different people. This is one of the key things for entrepreneurs to succeed. I co-founded the TBS Holding in 2008. We manage 130 locations across Egypt. Three years back, we came up with a partnership which gave birth to the first sourdough bread packaged on the shelf in Egypt. The Big Mac, the uh, McDonald's. When we hire here at TBS, we hire attitude, character, and then we teach them how to do the job. Social sciences are all about teaching you about the human being. Humanities, like literature, teaches you about human experience. Humans to me are like a puzzle. I wanted to go into a profession that helped people. I'm able to do what I love in Hus and not make it feel as if it's a chore or a burden. As a Hus student, what I have that differs me from everyone else, people skills and confidence and being able to communicate effectively. It opens a lot more doors than people think. And in the Middle East, a lot of those doors are being opened now. With our lack of mental health awareness, you also need people to take care of people. Because people who love what they do tend to do very well. And people who don't like what they do are often deeply unhappy. I was very unhappy in everything else. Theatre ended up being a lot more than what I expected. I've written two plays, I've managed, I've acted, which is something I never thought I'd be able to do because I'm an anxious person. It's always giving me so many opportunities. It's helped my confidence so much. It's helped me in almost every aspect in my life. If this society is growing, it will need filmmakers. It will need actors, it will need linguists. Anthropologists work in the gaming industry in Japan and in the United States. They work for massive corporations. Who is going to do that stuff? I was very lucky to have an environment that you know, left a lot of autonomy and into my decisions. So what makes us special is we have lots of margins of freedom, of speech, of participation, of opinion. We have top-notch faculty and some of the literature that we engage in are actually authored by some faculty that we have in university. You feel like you're living in what you're studying. Do you know who she is? She's the voice of Elsa. And then the, when the kids look at me like this and like, Elsa? After I won Star Academy, I came back and I changed my major because it was that serious for me right now. Last year, I got a phone call from Hisham Nazi. Turned out to be the Pharaoh's Golden Parade. I was very proud. It was one of my biggest achievements. If everything in the world fails, the one thing that will succeed is to enjoy what you're doing, because then everything suddenly falls in place. If we all follow the path that's very well trodden, we would have a very boring world. For people who are interested in the humanities and social sciences, this is going to be the beginning of a great journey. To be a lifelong learner, to be curious about everything, ask lots of questions. I want her to study something that would give her the best experiences in her life. That's what HUS offers, where you can come in and truly understand yourself and the people around you. And by understanding, we become more tolerant and more accepting of others. The way that it helps you develop as a person is very outstanding. Humanities teaches us to research, to understand, to think. And thinking makes us humans. It will be an opportunity to grow, to learn about who you are, and to learn about how the world works.